Hello everybody, Tom Davis, PJ Golf Professional here with another lesson overview. And here we have Dushan, who's been a relatively long term client and has made some really good improvements and certainly over the last over the last few weeks. Um, and I'll just play the, the video on the right here along and you can see that this is a pretty solid looking golf swing. Especially for the handicap level. So Dushan currently is about a 20 handicap. There's a few little things that if you were to look at this, you'd say, well, you know, the takeaway club gets a little bit outside. A little bit closed, but gets a nice position at the top. And the move down is very good. Worked very hard on some of his moves with the lower body, which is really starting to pay fruition now. It's very, very solid and through. The one thing we talked about in today's lesson was now that in terms of the ball flight, direction, trajectory was kind of okay. Distance was maybe a little low. Could do to maybe hit it a little bit higher. So it's in it pretty solid, pretty straight, not much curve, but a little bit lower, maybe not quite as far as he could do. And I'm looking at this action through the ball, you can see maybe where this comes from. So the Duchamp works through the ball. We see a lot of kind of right side bend, body stays down, maybe not making the most efficient use of extending his torso through the ball, which would help to maybe shallow out the angle of approach a little bit, deliver a little bit more loft and deliver a little bit more speed. So what we worked on was a feeling of really extending the hips and the upper body more through the ball, stretching them, trying to be taller, and also letting his head rotate a little more, be a little more free rather than keeping the head down. So what happens is the head stays down, body tends to stay in this right side bend. So the changes are really quite subtle, because really is at the point where the swing looks pretty good. So it's all about making small changes. So down into the ball again, pretty solid move here. And as you can see, as he comes through now, doesn't quite end up in quite as much right side bend. So if you look at his body, it's not as curved over. So the head has started to release and follow the ball a little bit more rather than staying down. Slightly changes the path the club comes out on, comes out and around him a little bit more. And through to the finish, extended, finishing a little bit higher. Rather than here, you can still see the right shoulder down at the ground there. And so this got about, initially, 4 or 5 metres more distance per club. But I think as this move becomes a little bit more comfortable, a little bit more second nature, he's going to be able to add a bit more speed into that. So again, a little bit more distance uh, and a little bit more height.